I'm OJ Danzi, an RF and microwave application engineer from Keysight Technology. And today we're going to talk about the PNAX and some of the new features that we've added to it. So the PNAX is our device characterization system. Um, in the first discussion, we're going to talk about our new um, modulated third source. So on the rear panel of the PNA, on the new versions, we've added a third optional source. Uh, we recently turned on the ability to modulate that third source with a digitally modulated waveform. Uh, in this demo, we're taking an 800 megahertz wide uh, signal at 2.4 gigahertz and up converting it to 28.4 gigahertz and then um, measuring EVM. Just to do proof of concept, we also coupled off a little bit of the signal coming out of the rear panel and we sent it into our oscilloscope that's running our vector signal analyzer software package. And we're doing a, a analysis of the baseband signal uh, using, using our software. Now we're going to go back over to our PNA and what we did was we up converted the 28 gig and from there we decided to do modulation distortion measurements on that signal and we're getting an EVM measurement of about 1.15% uh, going through the up converter which is extremely good. Another part of the system that we have set up now is the, luckily the device under test also has a down converter in it so we decided to do traditional uh, down converter measurements as well. So we're doing noise figure and gain. We're doing swept gain compression across, across the entire 2 gigahertz band. And then we're doing phase noise of the 2 gigahertz signal coming out. And we're doing group delay and phase ripple of the IF, uh, IF, uh, of the IF pass band as well. So the next time you need to do component or system measurements, think of the PNAX. It's a great tool to have in the lab. It completes all the measurements that most people need to do on components as a complete characterization system. Visit our website, which is www.keysite.com, and search on PNAX for the latest information. Thank you.